Once a couple in Ohio, expecting their first child, decided to commemorate the special occasion with a heartwarming photo shoot. However, their plans took an unexpected turn when their 10-year-old daughter couldn't make it to the shoot. Photographer Christian Safira, known for his creative ideas, proposed involving horses in the photo shoot. The couple hesitantly agreed, not knowing what to expect. Little did they know that this decision would lead to a series of unforgettable and heartwarming moments. The horse named Pockshot became the unexpected star of the photo shoot. Pockshot, with her elegance and gentle demeanor, added a magical touch to every frame. Her rich facial expressions seemed to mirror the emotions of the family. Christian Safira, the photographer, couldn't believe his luck as Pockshot effortlessly followed his directions, posing with grace and charm. With each click of the camera, Pockshot managed to steal the show. Her ability to mimic human expressions left the couple in awe and filled the photos with warmth and character. As Christine, the photographer, asked everyone to smile, Pockshot obediently flashed her own version of a grin, which sent the couple into fits of laughter. It was a photo shoot unlike any other, with Pockshot turning an ordinary session into a memorable experience. Her expressive eyes and playful demeanor captured the hearts of everyone present. The couple couldn't have imagined a more perfect addition to their family photo shoot. As they looked back at the photos, it was clear that Pockshot had a special place in their hearts. Her ability to connect with humans through her expressions was nothing short of remarkable. With 17 facial muscle movements, Pockshot communicated with a depth that transcended words. In the end, the couple realized that sometimes the most unexpected moments turn out to be the most cherished. Pockshot, the horse with a talent for bringing smiles and joy, had left an indelible mark on their hearts and on the photos that would remain treasured for a lifetime.